I came out because I honestly couldn't take being in the closet anymore. It was literally killing my soul. Because I'm a very like straightforward, like honest person. To feel like I was lying, it just felt just so awful to do that. My name is Kayla Kennelly. I'm a professional big wave surfer. Uh, I'm a DJ, a public speaker, and I actually started my own company, uh, um, board short brand called Active that makes high performance board shorts specifically for women. So that's I've got a lot of I've got a lot of hustles going. <laughs> so I came out um, my last couple of years on the pro tour. I didn't like make like a huge deal of it. I just kind of um, started bringing my girlfriends on tour with me and not saying like this is my friend, you know? I, I pretty much had to be in the closet or chose to be in the closet for most of my beginning of my professional career just because gays and lesbians were just really unwelcome in that space. And I was just terrified that I was gonna lose all my sponsors, you know, I wasn't gonna be able to realize my dream of one day becoming a, a, a world champion, so it was it was scary. Sometimes I wish I would have come out sooner, but at the same time, I, I, um, I got to benefit from straight privilege for a little bit. <laughs> so the reaction when I came out, I'm not gonna say it was like wonderful. <laughs> it took a little while. I mean, I came out like in, in, in the surfing world, which is like super homophobic. So that was really rough. You know, I kind of felt like the surfing community turned on me, whereas the, I was now part of the LGBT community. So it's like I gained a community and I felt like I kind of lost part of a community. So yeah, that was hard. My parents didn't take it super well in the beginning either, you know. Um, but I, you know, I had friends that were supportive and stuff. Prior to like actually coming out, you know, I would go to some like LGBT kind of parties and stuff, but just like act like an observer. When I when I came out, I, I kind of felt like I, I more belonged in that space, you know, whereas I felt like kind of a stranger prior. Being part of the community uh, feels really good just because there is that 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 sense of community, you know. I like DJing LGBT parties because you know you just feel like this sense of I'm in a space of no judgment here you know I can just be so I think that's the best part the advice I would give to those who haven't come out yet is that everybody needs to come out in their own time you know you should not feel pressured to come out before you're ready but I will say it, it, it will be one of the most freeing feelings you are, you'll ever have in your life when you actually work up the courage to do it.